So today's video is going to be pretty interesting. We are going to be going over specialized alpha items that are being released on the Chinese version of the game. Alright guys, welcome back to another Rocket League video and in this one, obviously we have some very interesting stuff to talk about. I mean, you guys can already tell by the title, the thumbnail, this is going to be a fun video. Kind of just like an information video because I'm not quite sure yet if it affects us in any way. But either way, if you guys are into items, trading, and just like seeing new items that are brought into the game, this is just a fun video, a cool announcement video so yeah guys if you enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like down below and let's just jump right into it so yeah this video has to do with the Chinese version of the game which is coming I believe it actually might be up right now at least it's in the alpha version of it which sounds a little bit odd because obviously Rocket League has been out of alpha for a long long time in the US the UK countries that already have the game but the Chinese version is kind of different and this happens with a lot of games that are re-released in China like Call of Duty has a special version in China I believe CSGO also has a special version. But yeah, as you guys already saw by like the logo for the Chinese version of Rocket League, it is a little bit different from ours. Now I'm not exactly sure how it's different right now, but you can even go to the site for the game and it's very interesting. I even translated the page and there's just, it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Like if you scroll down, there's this thing about December to open flying where the first test, the specific test date will be announced in the TGC. And then there's like 88 points, draw the first test activation code, which might actually have to do with this uh, alpha version of the game but even when you click that to grab it it brings you to this confusing page that's just like a mess of stuff and there's this thing of fuel supply station fuel value activity and like activation code fragment redemption activity I don't know it's super confusing but what I'm trying to say is the Chinese version is a lot different from ours and I think this has to do with the alpha version and also the special items that these Chinese players are able to get and I also find it funny how it always translates to Rocket Alliance instead of Rocket League I think that's just a translation error but yeah all of this stuff is fairly confusing except for one thing that is very very interesting. So this stuff was first discovered by a guy named Shuishi RL and I don't think I'm pronouncing that right apologies if I'm not but he was just browsing the forum for this Chinese version for whatever reason maybe he lives in China is actually able to play this version but basically on this forum it's like any forum for a video game but there's this interesting announcement that has to do with that first test on December 7th that I believe is the alpha or maybe the beta I really have no idea but as you can see it offers players some unique stuff. So first of all the boring stuff then we'll jump into the alpha items. But it's funny because they get a shrapnel helmet which is the Brody helmet for whatever reason that's honestly a really weird item to choose to give to players in the props package that they get on December 7th. But along with that you also get the flamethrower red which you know fits the color of like the Chinese flag stuff like that. So that one actually fits. And then they also get the super speed tire which is called something else in our version I can't quite remember it. Oh, they're actually called the Zippy Wheels. I just looked it up. So they're the ones with the Zippy car, which is kind of odd. It's funny that they added these wheels in. So maybe they don't get the Zippy. That's a little weird. But yeah, they get those three items. But then the most interesting thing is the custom alpha items. So below that, it says the first test carnival. Yeah, carnival. I don't think that's a right translation, but it says all the way to receive a good ceremony, which does not make sense. The completion of the specific conditions will also get the first test exclusive limited props, which are the special alpha items. So here here you guys go here is the picture that comes with this and yeah we have to talk about these <laughs> so as you can see guys they are the alpha items and also the beta nugget which is changed to be an alpha item this time but yeah as you can see it's the alpha items with a Chinese theme so first of all in the front you have the alpha cap but instead it's this bright red and yellow instead of the classic gold that we have on our versions which is definitely a very different looking topper kind of looks like a McDonald's kids meal but then behind the that you have the gold stone wheels which are really crazy instead of being completely golden again they take that sort of red and yellow but it's still the same shape you still have the same exact spokes as with the original gold stone wheels but instead they get the ketchup and mustard treatment now then to the left of it you have the beta nugget which looks like it has like some rubies inside of it which isn't too bad obviously it's the antenna it's not really that important anyways but it is kind of cool now then for the final item which we can't really get a good look at in this picture the red and gold alpha boost it looks interesting obviously it's just gonna be the gold rush boost with like a hint of red inside of it but do those two colors really go together i can't really say but i'm just super curious to see what it looks like in game as well as just all of these items i kind of just want to see if they look like super weird on the field or if you could come up with some cool customizations that's saying if we ever even are able to get our hands on these or if they're going to be exclusive to china only so yeah guys now that we've gone through these items themselves let's talk about whether or not we're going to be able to get the 
copies on our versions of the game or if they are going to be China exclusive. So the first thing I want to bring up is I actually asked Psyonix Cory himself about this if the Chinese version will be compatible with our versions of the game because I thought it would be kind of cool if you were able to trade with these with Chinese players somehow. Now he responded to that saying it won't be compatible which obviously means that this is probably a completely different version of the game. That's not to say that somewhere down the line maybe it will be compatible maybe we'll find some way in order to trade from these Chinese versions of the game to the other versions of the game but as of right now it's not looking like you're going to be able to trade for them. Now on the other hand will they bring these over to the versions that we're running? I don't believe so. Obviously they did the alpha items on PC and haven't made those available on the consoles and stuff like that so I don't think that will be the case but it's still interesting that they made completely new alpha items for the Chinese version but didn't do anything at all for Xbox and PS4 besides PS4 had the beta nugget and also Nintendo Switch now which does have the exclusive Mario items so overall Xbox kind of gets the short end of the stick here but yeah guys I don't think right now that we're going to be able to get these items but it's still interesting to see them they are custom alpha items after all they're probably going to be expensive on the Chinese market and I just thought you guys would enjoy hearing about them but anyways guys that is going to be it for today's video I hope you enjoyed it and if you're new to the channel be sure to subscribe for more item news like this in the near future as well as check out some of my previous videos here such as black market decals coming back into the game and then on the right using the two new gold explosions in game but other than that guys again I hope you enjoyed today's video I'm the llama sir and I will see you guys next time